developing news out of North Philadelphia as police announce a person of interest is in custody following a shooting near the Temple University campus that injured four people. We just learned one of those injured is, is in custody. Action News reporter Sharifa Jackson joins us live from police headquarters with the very latest. Sharifa. Yeah, Walter, as you said, we know that there is a person of interest right now, according to Philadelphia police, but we don't have too many details about who that person is. We know that he is 23 years old, and we also know that he is in critical condition at this time. We also know that he was shot by a security guard. Now, this is what we know all unfolded at around 3 a.m. It was at the Hookah Lounge on the 1000 block of Diamond Street underneath an off-campus apartment building for Temple University. It was also across the street from Temple University football team's practice field. Our investigators say before the shooting, a security guard was kicking out a man out of the lounge. The fight spilled onto the street when that individual pointed a gun at the security guard and the security guard shot that man once in the offender. He shot three women in the process. Now it's just the latest case of violent incidents around Temple University's campus. Our parents and our friends, they contact us and they're like, are you OK? And we're like, yeah, it's just another day. Even a block off campus, I think it, it's really dangerous. So I try to stay on campus as much as possible. And uh, I would recommend that for, for all students, honestly. My mom's always sending me like the keep us safe to you post. And she yeah. was like, what are we going to do? Like, can you transfer? And again, we know this person of interest, 23 years old, and very serious injuries at this point. The other victims, they range between 19 and 47 years old. Temple University says none of these people are students. We're live outside Philadelphia Police Headquarters, Sharifa Jackson, Channel 6, Action News. Walter. All right, Sharifa, thank you.